I think the goals uh, never change, um, and that's to compete for a SUNYAC title uh, year in and year out. Uh, I think uh, we have the foundation to do so, um, and we're looking forward to uh, rebounding nicely this year. Those returners got a lot of experience uh, last year. Um, one of the returners is coming off of uh, an injury year, um, and he's our captain. One of our captains, Malik Saleh. Um, obviously, Andrew Seniak has been a big piece uh, to what we do, uh, what have, what we've done. And with uh, the freshmen that garnered a lot of minutes last year with Nick Paquette, Matt Misser, uh, Corey Garcia, and uh, Brandon Tolliver, you know, we're, we're looking forward to kind of seeing where uh, this group of returners leads and, and helps blend with the newcomers coming in. Really, it's, it's been a whole new uh, vibe and energy um with nine newcomers you know it's a lot of teaching and and they all uh vary from freshmen to you know we have a couple of sophomore transfers a couple of junior transfers and they all bring different strengths um you know a lot of people that have been around different programs like james saunders and kevin coyle and patty parr bring an experience uh to them but also the the freshmen have really stepped into roles that have been quite impressive and, and they've really heightened the level and uh of competitiveness and talent in practice you know with with all the freshmen from uh freshmen from matt english to nick arthur to bryce lane um, to Tristan Wisseman, to Conrad Deland, a local boy. You know, we, we, we've really stepped up the talent here, and, and I really look forward to seeing what this group of, of young uh, can mix with, with the old. Oh, my, my thing is, is with our non-conference schedule, we got to play the best. Um, you know, Vassar has been a, a, a very competitive local game for us year in and year out. Um, and it's developing into a rivalry. Uh, the Allegheny tournament, you know, we open up with Allegheny and it's their home opener, um, but that's like an eight hour trip. Um, so it's similar to a Fredonia Buffalo state trip for us, which we'll be making in the winter months here for the SUNYAC play. And, you know, we, we continue to play uh, high quality teams like Middlebury who won the NESCAC last year. Um, we're playing Stevenson at home uh, from down south and you know we play Springfield from the New Mac uh, who has been you know an NCAA participant year in and year out. So those non-conference games will prepare us for the SUNYAC you know and uh, I, I think I think we can compete. If we compete well in them I, I think we should do well. Yeah, th this year's, um, you know, is, is one stop, and that, that's one stop at a time uh, for us. Uh, we're coming in with a high uh, defensive mindset. Um, we start out with seven road games. Uh, I'm of the philosophy that defense travels. Um, so, you know, I'm hoping um, that that philosophy continues to be one of the cornerstones of our program for years to come. Um, the players have really bought into it. And they've really brought an even more intense and aggressive style uh, to the defensive side of the ball. So I'm really looking forward to seeing that. It's just been a really uh, exciting time. I uh, brought on two new staff members in uh, Coach Connor Smith, uh, who played and was captain at NYU. And then I brought in uh, Coach Drew uh, Skomberg from uh, he played at St. Lawrence and is there in their Hall of Fame, and then you add him to both myself and, and Coach Jim Wary, who's been with me now for three seasons. The staff has really come together, and I think we've seen that in the development in our players. Um, they've really adhered to the teaching, and they're starting to make the transition, translation from practice to game situations, which is really rewarding to see. And the new group, um, you know is really blending together nicely uh, so I look forward to seeing where this where this group can go I think they're gonna shock a lot of people and uh, and they've they've really bought in so I'm looking forward to uh, basically showing the brand of basketball that that we know we can play and uh, it's a high intense style uh, on both sides of the ball but it will start and end with the defense